<laughs> Thought you knew me better than that. I don't know, Gucci. <laughs> How well do you know me? <laughs> I don't know you very well. All right. Knowing Ozone, this is probably something like a 70-30 matchup in Duck Hunt's favor, because that's just Ozone opinions. That, uh, you know what? Let Ozone do him. I mean, he can have those opinions. Exactly. And I mean, as long as he can, as long as he can uphold his results. Yeah, I mean, he's done a very, very good job of doing that. So starting off the match, a lot of cans being thrown out, Duck Hunt things, you know. Yeah, I'm assuming more rush down coming from the Fox, but. Meek's really just kind of struggling to get in, it looks like. But he's got a foothold right now. Yeah, very, very much. It seems like a very even game so far. The only thing is that Duck Hunt's not necessarily at a disadvantage on ledge because of this toolkit. It actually kind of creates a trap system. It's really, it's yeah, really kind of weird. Yeah, as long as you can get, uh, get the can out there and uh, put out the gunner guy, it's pretty much a guaranteed get off, uh, get off ledge free card. Yeah. So we're gonna probably be seeing a lot of that, but I, I'm expecting, I'm hoping Meek starts using the lasers more to get the uh, can direction change. Yeah, that is, an, uh, that is an interesting thing. I never thought about uh, Fox lasers redirecting can as well. Cause yeah. Move that hits it. it. It's actually very, uh, very interesting. Yeah, if you saw Larry at uh, Big House, that's exactly what it did. Anytime, a, uh, I think it was Rito, and anytime a can came out, he shot a little, little two, laser. three lasers, yep. and he was fine. That's, yeah, that's the interesting part, uh, part about the, uh, part about the uh, can. I, I like the mechanic where um, each time it gets hit, it changes direction because it can like cause a lot of situations and traps. Well, but it also seems like an unfair uh, unfair advantage to people like Fox who have very like quick projectiles. Yeah, it's not necessarily. Oh wow, that was a really Ooh. good down smash coming from the back hit coming first, bouncing him about. Good lord. Um, <laughs> Yeah, it's, it's not even necessarily that any hit changes direction, it's whatever direction the attacker is facing. So what that ends up doing is things like Duck Hunt, if he hits it with his back air, he's still facing the other way, and so he'll smack it to the other side of the stage, but it'll still come towards him, yeah. which creates a lot of different uh, like grab traps and kill options. Mm -hmm. But you're absolutely right, Fox seems like an incredibly rough matchup for this just because of how, you know, how much he can switch the can, but yeah. it doesn't, Meek is not utilizing yeah. that nearly enough. Definitely, Meek needs to uh, needs to actually um, you, uh, utilize his strong projectile uh, projectiles to uh, redirect the can away from him. See, I like how that he had that ledge stall going on with the can, preventing Meek from going up and trying to you know fade away back air him. Yeah. Just keeping it going forward. Okay, Ooh, good down good smash, down smash. catching nice the punch. unsafe landing. Mm -hmm. I do really like watching Duck Hunt. It's it, it's actually very entertaining you know, for me because you can see all these like. You could look into the brain of a duck hunt player and see what traps are good for which situations and when, when, when not to use the cannon gun and everything. See, everyone's talking about the Rosa Luma 2v1. What about this 4v1 going on right now? <laughs> We're not going to mention that. You got the can, you got the duck. I'm going to even put, yeah, I'll put the duck on there. It's a 5v1. Oh, it's this a 5v1. Is, yeah, this is busted. Duck hunt is busted, as can. Ozone will tell you. The can, the duck, oh, the duck. Oh, so close. Just waiting for the grab. That would have been very, very cool to see. Oh. Yep, totally got the... Yep. He just completely trapped in the seat. Unless he hit the ledge, there was no way he was getting out of that scot free. Well, the issue was he was completely fixated on the can, and so he probably didn't even know where he was in relation to... Probably because he was too worried about Ozone's uh, very good control of the can. Yeah, because if, if he had kept waiting, he most likely would have been hit by the can, so he was forced to react much sooner than he had to. Exactly. And, you know, trying to... Trying to multitask like that, it's really brutal. <laughs> it is very, very brutal. All right, game two going to Triplats. Seems to be the general counter pick in this matchup for Fox. Yeah, that sounds about right. Especially going to Dreamland because of the low ceiling. Mm -hmm. Get the up airs off. You're not really going to die from the can on ceiling very often. Yeah, not very often. More up to the side, so yeah. that's good. The thing is, Me uh, Meek wasn't really um, getting too much off of the... Um, like top blast zone, he wasn't getting those up air kills. Like, yeah, I think I got, I think I got two up air confirms that entire game. So I, I don't know how much the counter pick will help him. I know in general, Fox, this is usually a good counter pick to go with Fox. I think he's really looking for that mobility. The that is, yeah, that yeah. Because while can is you know great, you have side special and down special. They're really not gonna. Bother him while he's on platforms. Can's the only thing he yeah, really has to worry about. Platforms are like his little safe, er uh, safe area. Mm -hmm. Except Ozone is just proving that to be wrong. <laughs> he, he disagrees he, he, wholeheartedly. He's hearing us in the comment uh, through the uh, mics. I'm sure he is. 
Oh, he's got the headphones on. Wait, <laughs> Ozone, what are you doing? <laughs> no, Ozone is uh, uh, oh, the very good. Raunchy F smash. <laughs> Come out. Ooh, oh, double. A, a double F smash, though. Oh, yeah, can, can just yeah, can count. I, it's, every time, like, when oh. a duck hunt, like, throws out the can, like, automatically right away and they get, you know, like, explodes and gets hit, I always think it's just, like, a counter. Exactly. It's just, like, a Martha, uh, Martha, uh, Ike counter or something like that. But you can move it around. Yeah, exactly. Oh! <laughs> can oh, he, saving Ozone! He, yeah, he could have probably gone for, uh, for an up air, but I'm guessing he, he uh, thought Meek was gonna anticipate that. I think it was just the disarray like of right what there. was going on, because he had, you know, you have the angle flying out off to the right side, expecting death, but then getting sent off to far left. Yeah. Probably needed a second to recuperate. Oh, yep. good back air. Ooh, Trying back. to save it with the fair, but that was uh, that was almost good. Uh, good DI by Ozone. He, uh, almost. <laughs> he, he, he he almost survived. It comes up. Yep. Yeah. There we go. There Here's we the go. Strength. Oh, see, oh. but the can. Yeah, exactly. See, it's like a counter. Yeah. It's it's kind of like a. Uh, yeah. You see him spamming moves. Just uh, just throw a can. Yeah. It's like rush coil for Mega Man. It's like I don't like this situation. So I'm gonna I'm gonna get out of this situation right now. Right there. Oh. Ooh. Oh. oh. Oh! Oh, <laughs> oh but at, at the end of the day, F okay. smash, just because why not? A lot of cool things, Some uh, it didn't happen, and then just get a raw F smash. Might as well. Yeah, I mean, at the end of the day, it makes like.